Stump is really eating into my tractor budget. Explosives? Great! If we put charges on the load-bearing walls, we can blow up detention hall while leaving the art room unharmed. Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> well done, boy! Wait, here comes the Mykia. What's a Mykia? Mykia! <laughs> Who here knows what a family tree is? Ooh, family trees. The charts representing genealogical relationships in a branching structure. I can't wait to see what noble branches lie in the Simpson family foliage. Yeah, the Simpson family is a long line of horse thieves, dead beats, horse beats, dead thieves, and even a few alcoholics. Lisa, you're gonna find more than you bargained for. So what are you looking for? Family records for a school project on genealogical... Hey, that's great. Hmm, Dad's idea pad. Oh, so dusty. The diary of Eliza Simpson? I warn you, I don't know what's in there, but if it's about a Simpson, you ain't gonna be proud. It's the journal of a sweet little girl. Keep reading, honey. Dearest Diary, today I am the happiest girl in Springfield. See? Oh, God. I can't believe we're descended from slave owners. Me neither. For once, the Simpsons were in management. In my elegant gown, no one will suspect that I'm actually on a mission to help my very first slave escape to freedom. That's a great story, Lisa, and you should stop reading right there. I must know. You still reading that thing? I'm warning you, when something goes into that vent, it shouldn't come out. I'm here to help you. Follow me north to freedom. I don't think so. Why, because I'm young and I'm a woman? No, because you're pointing south. <laughs> Where do you think you're going? <coughs> After them, but obviously. Well, you didn't say it. Escape seemed impossible. What happened next? I'll never know if Eliza got Virgil safely to freedom. Cheer up, sweetie. Maybe we can find the answer in the library. There are no books about an Eliza Simpson, but I did find this. Ooh, a cookbook. <gasps> That's Eliza's mother. Many years ago, my daughter Eliza brought a runaway slave, Virgil, to the house. <gasps> They made it back to the house? Luckily, they chanced upon a traveling circus. So, you got any talent? Well, I am a bit musical. The sun shines bright. Rule number one, never be better than me. And I'm pretty bad. No way, he'll get me in trouble. Maybe you change your mind about me after you try some of my wheel cakes. Wheel cakes? You can stay. So they did the right thing. <laughs> My quest is fulfilled. Our family has heroes! My Black History Month presentation is called The Simpsons, The First Family of Freedom. Bravo, Lisa. Very entertaining. But then again, fairy tales always are. Another diary, that of my great, great, great grandfather, Milford Van Houten. Oh, boy. That's one of Virgil's sugar sprinkled cake rings. Now, where is he? Ah, dastard! <laughs> Renegade! <laughs> Mooncuff! <laughs> I can't tell you where he is. I swore an oath! Every man has his price. No one is better at determining said price. Then yours truly. <laughs> now, where's my man? In a turnip shed. Now, what's my surprise? Your surprise is a new pair of shoes. Oh, my God. That surprise is so pleasant. No, you lie. Eliza Simpson can't be a coward. She's the only decent ancestor I have. But I need to prove that my ancestor couldn't have backed down to Colonel Burns. Colonel Burns? Why, I haven't heard my father's name in years. And it's been quite a life. Any regrets? Just one. When I was a girl, I witnessed a grave injustice, but I held my tongue. <gasps> There's no noble Simpson. 
Aw, oh, don't cry, Meat Pie. Things worked out pretty well for Virgil in the end. What are you talking about? Listen, Wrinkles, if you know something that'll cheer up my little girl, you'd better spill it, or I can make things very uncomfortable for you. Mabel knew her husband well, so she had cooked up a little payback pie. <laughs> Get off my property, Colonel Burns. I knew you'd break your promise. Now, I'm taking Virgil to freedom. You defied your husband for me? Man, this is the 60s. By the time they crossed into Canada, things had changed. So you're actually descended from Virgil, not Hiram. Papa, why'd you try to keep us from finding this out? People of my generation are, you know... Racist. That's it. 